that was the most devastating hours of my life because I knew down inside that some that something happened to her, something terrible. 29-year-old Carissa Hamilton's family is devastated and confused. Never did I imagine someone would have hurt her because she was a good person. She was a kind person. So that was one of the worst moments of my life, having to look for her and being told, no, she's not here. On February 5th, Carissa's family hadn't heard from her. They started driving around Phoenix and calling hospitals to see if she may have gotten into some sort of accident. But then they got a call that changed their lives. Carissa Hamilton was found shot to death in her car. Her car engine still on and no one around to help police find who killed her. We just don't understand how this could have happened to her. She didn't mess with anyone. The Yuma native was a single mother to her three-year-old son. She was also a daughter, cousin, and friend. She had big dreams, graduating from both ASU and NAU. She wanted to be a sports reporter. To see those dreams taken away from her, it's, it's not only devastating to me, but it's devastating to entire family. Chris's mom says she was humble, kind, and encouraged her to be better. <laughs> she was my world. Phoenix police say they need the community's help. There is now a $10,000 reward for information leading to an arrest in this murder case. We know somebody's out there that has a little bit of information. And while Chris's family keeps searching for answers, they're also reminiscing on moments with her they wish they had more of. And the last thing she said to me when she got in the car was, see you later. So I want to say now, Carissa, see you later. Now, Chris's family says she did not live in the area near the park, so they're still just not sure why she was in that area. Again, police have very little information here. They are asking anyone who may know something or had seen something to call them or silent witness at 480 Witness. Live in Phoenix tonight, I'm Holly Bach for Arizona's Family.